Well, this is a great morning to sleep in. Just... And that is just what Barry Zavan <laughs> decided to do. Barry has a little trouble with daylight savings time. However, he is still not going to get out of doing the weather forecast for us. And we join Barry Zavan live at home. Good morning, <laughs> Barry. Well, good morning. Here I am, the pot at the end of the rainbow. Look at him. Oh, boy. You look da fantastic. Daylight saving time really gets to you sometimes, <laughs> and I just couldn't. I promise I'll be in later this morning, though, <laughs> for sure. Yeah, I better be here. I'll be here for uh, permanent. One question, Barry. What did you do with your wife? Hmm? What well, did you do with your wife? In the basement. Oh, you're going to have an interesting day, Barry. <laughs> Let's take a look at what, what's happening right now. Our current conditions raining 59 degrees, wind southeast at 10 miles an hour. And the dew point at 58, humidity 96%. And the pressure right now is falling at a very low 29.40 inches of mercury. And that's accounting for our... Uh, wind and our rain. Uh, there are wind advisories on the lakes this morning and uh, for much of the rest of the afternoon they're going to pick up to about 30 miles an hour. Let's take a look uh, right now at our uh, live Doppler 11 radar and we see that uh, all the shower activity, most of the heaviest shower activity anyway, has uh, scooted off to the north of the metropolitan area and uh, we expect that that's going to be the situation uh, for much of the rest of the day. Most of the showers now have ended and we expect that that's just going to be the case uh, now uh, from here on out, uh, at least till the next rainstorm develops. But we we have uh, the satellite photo right now, which will show um, the uh, the cloud cover, which uh, will extend its influence all the way from northern Minnesota down to the Gulf of Mexico, and that that uh, semicircular. A band of clouds is a very good indication of where the leading edge of the front is, which is bringing in some of the cooler, drier air. To the west of the Twin Cities in the Dakotas, we expect that uh, some of that rain may change to snow later today. There are Stockman's advisories up there. Much cooler air moving in behind it, but as far as any uh, major problems here, all we expect is rain and some drying. One good thing is the fact that the uh, drier air moving in, the high winds we're going to have later today and tomorrow, will uh, dry uh, many of the fields uh, and uh, hopefully will allow farmers to begin some planting or continue their planting operations and also uh, help us to mow our lawns uh, by the time the middle of the week comes. Take a look right now at uh, the um, um, the forecast for later today, which uh, shows uh, temperatures in the mid-50s here in the uh, central and eastern part of the state. It'll be a little cooler than that up north, and maybe a snow flurry or two in northwestern Minnesota, but nothing about which to worry. And 75 expected in Denver today, a 52 out in Seattle, Tacoma, 87 expected Dallas-Fort Worth, 86 uh, down in Miami, where they're going to have extremely hot conditions continuing, as they have uh, for much of the uh, past uh, few days. And storms will develop, too, over the uh, deep south. The uh, forecast uh, specifically for today, the 11 outlook is for showers, 53 to 58 for our highs, and winds will be southeast, becoming northwest at 10 to 15, and maybe beyond that. And then tonight, partly cloudy skies, lows 38 to 43, winds will be northwest at 8 to 18, and the 11 outlook for tomorrow, beautiful day, 54 to 59, the highs, winds out of the west at 10 to 15, and uh, the outlook for the rest of the week calls for showers redeveloping on Wednesday with 57, Thursday, partly cloudy at 55, and and partly cloudy on Friday in 57, so the drying conditions will uh, prevail <laughs> once again. Somehow it's so hard to take him seriously. I know. Well, he, he did a marvelous job, though. I, is it easier yeah. lying down? I, <laughs> well, yeah, I got my TV right over here. You see, I can just <laughs> see. This, this could become a habit, I can tell. I, I, I have a feeling it won't. <laughs> In fact, we have a phone call right now uh, for Mr. Kirby. I don't think it'll be a habit. Yes, it's right here, Barry. Oh, Would you like no. it? Well, I'll be in okay. in one minute. Thank you, <laughs> Thank you sir. Thank You're you. Barry Zavan, live from his home. In his bed. <laughs> Coming up on Sunrise, Minnesota Strikers. No. No.